Hello you guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new, my name's Lauren. I'm heading over to my friend Maya's house because she's moving into a new apartment and I'm helping her move. And then we have some friends coming into town from South Florida that were here a few weeks ago. They're actually moving here. So they're coming up to sign their lease. So they're staying with us tonight so they can sign it tomorrow. And we'll probably go out to dinner tonight with them and things like that, so. Just got a coffee and some egg white bites and now I'm gonna head over to her apartment. Please ignore the clothes that I have hanging up to dry. I like dry all my pants and like my workout leggings and workout shorts. That's how I dry them. I just ordered a drying rack off Amazon. I don't know why it took me so long to do this, but now that I rearranged my closet in a different way, I don't have spots to like hang up clothes to dry so i'm like hanging them on like every door handle and on this um alex drawer too so i got some stuff in the mail that i wanted to share with you guys or like i picked up some stuff not like everything's in the mail like i went and bought this stuff like in the store i guess i'm gonna start off with they're all like holiday scents but um i got some candles first i got two of them from bath and body works they were doing what's the sale it's like basically two for the price of one three wick candles that are 12.95 and this past week they were doing the sale and i feel like that's when i i really love trying different candles out from different companies different stores so i kind of only tend to buy the bath and body works candles when they are on sale and um also when they don't have like all of the designs on the outside i like the minimal ones specifically from the white barn collection um i got tree farm and i ordered these online and picked them up so i didn't smell them in the store i just went based off of reviews and um the first one i got is tree farm and i love how on the bottom it like tells you exactly what it smells like and this one was really highly rated there's tree farm and then there's another christmas tree scent this one is a little bit more intense and really nice so it's crisp pine needle warm cider and spiced apple and i feel like it mainly smells like a fresh christmas tree i kind of smell the spiced apple but it's very light it just complements the christmas tree scent so i got this one and then i got the perfect christmas and i didn't even realize that they're christmas colors but so this is the perfect christmas it's Kind of along the same lines of tree farm it's fresh cut pine cinnamon sugar toasted and toasted marshmallow the fresh cut pine is very light and i smell mostly like the toasted marshmallow and like slight cinnamon sugar but it smells really good if you like like sweet candles um kind of like cake battery but christmassy it smells really good so I'll link these both down below if you're interested. Oh, the price went up. They're $26.50 now. I thought they were like $24. So I guess the price did go up a little bit. But yeah, I usually just buy them on sale. They do make the whole entire apartment smell good, which is why I mainly like them. But I know that they're not the best for you to breathe in. Target actually has all of their holiday stuff out. So I really do want to make time to go tomorrow to kind of like browse through it. Um, I ordered these through the Target mobile app and I did mobile pickup. So I had these last year and I'll insert a picture right here of what it looks like. I really loved the look of it. I had like a little Christmas tree and then like these big five wick candles and they're huge. It's the holiday balsam scent and it's in the green container. I know that they have like a creamish one. I do wish that this was cream or more of a neutral because this would be a really nice bowl to um, take all of the wax out once it's completely burned through and use that as like a little bowl So I kind of wish it was a little more neutral and I did get two of them So I got two because last year I only got one and I was like scrambling searching for a second one Once I burned through the whole thing because it smells so good and I love having this big thing on my little center island on my you guys have seen it it's like where i keep my coasters and i have two pumpkins there right now and another candle and then my wick cutter and i love having stuff on there that kind of goes with the seasons so this candle is going to be on there i'm not sure when i'll like switch it out i might want to burn the tree farm one coming up 
and then put these out once it hits like December. I kind of forgot about them and bought these and then that same day I was like let me see if Target actually has the big five wick candles that I bought last year because I loved them and they did. So I love to swap out the candles based on the season as I'm sure all of you guys do too. So I'll link these down below. They're definitely some of my favorite scents for the season. Anyway, so I got those. And then lastly, I'm so excited about these and I got them off of Revolve. And I got these fuzzy brown Birkenstocks and um, I kind of wish I could wear these year round because they're so cute and so comfortable. They are literally the cutest shoes and i can't wait till it gets like a little bit colder here in orlando because i will be wearing these so i was really excited about these these are like my first pair of the slide double strap style birkenstocks maybe once spring and summer come back around i'll purchase the ones without the fur in it depending on how much i like these but I did size up on them. So I originally ordered them in my normal size, which is a size 37, I believe. So it's a size 37 and the fur on it kind of takes up space in the shoe. So I sized up to a size 38. So I did want to share that stuff with you guys because I did just recently grab it all. And um, yeah, so I'm just like cleaning up the house right now because we do have people coming in to stay with us and they're coming like a little bit earlier than I thought. So I'm like kind of trying to clean up because they're staying in our extra bedroom, which is where I'm sitting right now. And um, just finishing up some laundry. The UCF game's gonna be on in about 30 to 45 minutes. That's what's going on today. And then tomorrow, I just have to like go to the grocery store, do some, do some things. And I really do want to get my first like fall holiday drink from Starbucks and walk around Target and just look at their holiday stuff. I'm not guaranteed to probably pick anything up. I do still want to look and um, maybe I'll get something small, like a little small decoration piece to just add to whatever because I still have like the little Christmas tree, the little light up one that we have from last year, if you guys have been following me and it like lights up when it gets dark outside. It's like on a timer, which I love because usually when I come home from work, it's like pitch black outside during the, the winter time. So it's nice when I come home and all the lights are out that the Christmas trees, like the little Christmas tree on the counter is lit up because it's on that timed schedule, but I'll still probably look and just browse and maybe pick up something small. But anyways, um, I'll probably pick up the camera later once we're doing things. Okay, since our friends aren't gonna be here for like 30, a little over 30 minutes, I think I'm just gonna go to Target right now and look at the holiday stuff and just see what they have. I'm a little impatient and I don't want to wait until tomorrow. So we're going to do that right now. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna do a haul in the bedroom because the UCF game is on in the other room. But the holiday section at Target is so good. I could have gone even crazier, but I picked up a basket instead of a cart. So I only grabbed what I could carry. But I got some dish towels. I never really change out our dish towels and I thought it would just be a fun way to get into the season. And these were in the little $1, $3, $5 section in the beginning. So I picked up both of these. And I feel like it would just be something fun to add to the little handle on the oven. So I got these. I got each of these for the bathroom. I got the bigger one for the like common area bathroom. Because our second bedroom, the bathroom has two doors. So it opens up into the kitchen area. So I got this one for that bathroom because I feel like I burn a candle in there more than I do the master bathroom, I guess. So I got the smaller one and these were relatively inexpensive. This is $5 and it smells really, really good. But I figured that these would be good for the bathrooms and then the pattern on it was kind of 
festive as well. And then this I really didn't need, but I thought, I don't know where I'm gonna put it yet. Maybe on the center island. So just a nice little vase. Maybe put some fake plants in here. I don't know how well it will hold like actual water with real flowers in there. So we'll figure that out. I'll see where we're gonna put that. And lastly, I'm so excited. We have the oldest doormat it's been with us for, this is our third year living in our apartment. It's been with us for all three of those. And it was originally bought when my boyfriend lived with his roommates. Yes. And they're so inexpensive. This was $12. They're so inexpensive that I don't know why we, it just wasn't a need to buy a new one. So it's going on four years that that doormat has been in use. So it's just time to get like a little bit better of a one. I know that this one's very seasonal. I'll take a clip of it outside of our door, but um, I know it's very seasonal and everything, but it was $12 and then after the holiday season, we'll just get a new one that's inexpensive $12. I don't know why I thought they were like 35, 40 bucks and I was like, I don't really need it, it's fine. But they're $12, which is really affordable. So I'll link everything that I got down below. If you guys are interested, this candle smells incredible. So I know I'm like, this vlog is so candle heavy, but um, really good option for a Christmas tree scent for a good price at Target. And they have really big ones too, like huge ones that are $30, I think. But this was 10 and this was five. So that's a little haul. Could have done more damage, but I'm proud of myself for only grabbing a basket. This is our old mat compared to the new one. Look how old that looks. We just changed and we got ready to go to a place called Banberries. It's kind of like a sports bar. Um, I'll take a few clips while we're there, but I'm wearing my new Cuts tee that I showed in the last vlog and I'm wearing it in the white um, one that's thicker and I really like it. So I'll link my shirt down below and I'll also link the 15% off discount code for you guys. I think this one's nicer for kind of dressing up and the other one that I wore last weekend that I shared, which was a little bit looser and a little bit boxier, and it was in that nude color, is a little bit more casual wear. But um, I'm just kind of like wearing it, I guess pretty casual too, but you can obviously dress it up even more. So I'll link it. It's a little bit later in the day. I have just been cleaning and picking things up and doing laundry because we did have friends stay last night. So I've just been like cleaning up the bathroom. I'm about to go run some errands. I am going to Target because I ran out of cleaning, Mrs. Meyer's cleaning product and they came out with their holiday scents for like this multi-surface cleaner. And I absolutely loved the fall scent. I think it was like acorn spice or something like that i literally loved it it smells so good but i really want to dabble into their holiday scents so i am gonna head to target pick that up because it's cheaper to get it at target than it is at publix and i'm not sure publix carries like a wide variety of the mrs myers so i'd rather get it at target and then i'm going to aldi because they have good deals on turkeys and we're hosting a friendsgiving next saturday and it's my first time cooking a turkey i asked my dad if he would help me and i know that sounds like super silly but i don't want to mess it up and i feel like he's obviously cooked so many turkeys in his lifetime and it'll be a great way for us to like spend the day together we can like cook our friendsgiving turkey spend the day and i can learn how to cook it with him so i like know because eventually i'll have like a family of my own and be hosting thanksgiving and friendsgiving and whatever for like years to come so i definitely want to know and like learn with him and i think it would just be like a fun experience to do it together so i'm going to my dad's next saturday before our friendsgiving to do that so i'm gonna go to aldi to get it because apparently there's like a really good deal on 
turkey there. So I'm gonna go there and then I'm gonna go take it to his freezer because my freezer cannot physically hold a turkey right now. So I'm gonna go drop it off at his um, house and put it in his freezer and he'll like take it out a few days before I come over to cook it to thaw in the fridge because he has like a huge outside fridge that's in the garage, a big freezer in the garage as well. So there's like tons of extra room for me to put stuff there. So I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna head back up here, go to Publix to get our groceries for the week. So it's a few different grocery stores, a little bit of errands to run. Just the usual Sunday stuff. I did wanna mention this before I continue. The one con that I have about the Rode lip balms, and I think all of their products are kind of like the same. The outside of the tubes or all of their products, they don't like hold up well in purses. Look at, it's like wearing on the outside and like all I do is shove that in my purse and it just like peels and wears on the lid and like all of them do that when I just, and I just throw them in like a little pocket in the purse. It's not like I just have them loose in there. They're like in a little side pocket and it does that to every single one of them and I don't like it. Like here's another one. Like it just does it to all of them. So, I mean, that's like just, I don't know, poor packaging, but it's like the one con. I still love it. It's just the packaging's not great. Like the longer that I have them, I'm like, okay, this packaging sucks. And I thought it was just like one tube of it, but I noticed that it was happening to like all the tubes that I throw in purses. I don't love that, that it like peels off. But anyways, I'm gonna head to Target, share the scent that I get, um, go to Aldi and head to my dad's to drop it in his freezer and then head to Publix. <laughs> okay, you guys, I went to Target. I went to Aldi, which I kind of like need to take time to like go into Aldi again, instead of just like rushing to find the turkey, I need to like browse in there um, to like see, because I kind of like saw their prices and they are really good prices, especially if you're interested in getting a turkey um, go to Aldi. I got a 15 pound turkey for $16. That's almost half the price of Publix. It comes frozen. So heavy. <laughs> um, but definitely go to Publix because I almost just paid double for a turkey and it's literally the same exact thing. Definitely check it out if you are interested or if you're hosting a Friendsgiving. And I went to Target and I couldn't find this on the shelf that I asked an employee because I looked up on the Target app. I was like, oh, maybe it's sold out. Like I'll order it online or and just pick up like a regular year round scent. And then it said it was in stock. So I asked an employee and I was like, hey, is this in stock? Like, am I just missing it on the aisle, blah, blah, blah. And she goes, it's probably in our back um, storage area. So she found two of these and these were the only, this was the only scent that was in stock and it's the Iowa pine scent and it smells just like a Christmas tree. So I love how I still have pumpkins sitting out. It's gonna be perfect to add to, um, because these like really smell up the apartment, like help it smell really nice once you clean off the countertops. So I feel like this will be really nice to have um, for the winter time to clean off the counters in this fall i mean not fall like winter holiday season scent i'm really excited so i got two of them um to have and i wish they had the other scents that i could smell like in person there's like a snowball one and then like a orange clove one and a peppermint the orange clove might be a fall scent i'm not sure but there's like a couple of them but i got this scent i can link it down below it smells really good just like a christmas tree if you're into that scent for the holiday season. I'm so excited. So I wanted to share that. Anyways, I'm gonna put this turkey in my dad's freezer, then head home. Um, but yeah, seriously, check out Aldi. I am definitely need to make time, maybe like next weekend, to like go in there and really browse and look for things. I know I have like certain grocery stores that are like home base where I buy the things there because they have those certain items that I want, if that makes sense. But if um, there's like really discounted prices at Aldi that have like cheaper, better options, I definitely want to take those into account because grocery shopping can get really expensive. So I'm really glad that I found this there. So I'm gonna go put this away, then head to Publix. Oh. 